place into our journey with Scenic in Alaska. And already, this wild and wonderful state has delivered some incredible experiences. And the beauty of traveling by ship is that we get to see it from every angle. There were whales breaching off the bow. That was just truly magical. It was just amazing. It was the most beautiful setting and just seeing the wildlife everywhere and just right off the boat, it was just absolutely beautiful. Skagway is today's port of call. With a compact town centre filled with restored buildings and historic shop fronts, it's easy to lose a few hours just strolling the colourful streets. Skagway, which actually means windy city, if you can't half tell. It appears today to be this picture-perfect town where tourism pretty much is the only industry here. I think there's 27 jewellery stores and one general store. In the winter, there's around about 800 locals. But come the summer months when the cruise ships arrive, you can get around 15,000 visitors per day. And I've got to tell you, it is first class. It is beautiful. But Skagway has such a gritty gold rush history it's worth the time to peel back the layers. During the gold rush days, over 40,000 people passed through this settlement. And with its brothels, its gunfights and unsavory characters, it earned itself a pretty darn nasty reputation. Oh, it was a, it was a pretty dangerous place. It's, you know, we say it's a cute little drinking town with a tourist problem now, but 120 years ago, it was one of the most dangerous places you could have found. In our heyday, in Skagway's heyday, in 1899, this two square mile town had 80 brothels, 120 saloons. One still remains, the Red Onion Saloon, and there's often a lineup out the door for their daily tours. Day trips in Skagway cater to every age and every interest, from the historic White Pass and Yukon Route Railroad to heading out to the Tongass National Rainforest for a truly Alaskan experience. I know that for, for mushing, for spores mushing, it's all about the dog. Um, and now there's an incredible um, experience that you can do here in Skagway. Tell us a little bit about that for those of us that, that are fascinated and, and also love the dogs. Yeah, yeah, here at Alaska X, we give a one mile mush to guests off the cruise ships and, and it's a lot of fun. The dogs will pull them in a non-motorized cart for one mile and then they get to pet the dogs afterwards. Dog mushing is this state's national sport and the fascination with it peaks every year with the epic I did a rod race. It's a little over a thousand miles long. It starts in Anchorage and finishes in Nome, and it's a um, it's a tough race. It can be very stormy weather, cold temperatures. All right, are you guys all set? Go! Ready? All right. This is a right to mush state, which means the dogs have right of way on the trails. Everybody lives for this. The dogs are born and bred for this kind of work. They love it, and when they get noisy, that's because they just want to go running. Alaska's Inside Passage rates as one of the world's most popular cruises. And look at this, the scenery, the wildlife on top of that, it is amazing. So for your chance to win your very own cruise here, listen up. 